One, the Targaryens do this. Um, Aegon the Conqueror, the, uh, the Targaryen who conquered all of Westeros and united the Seven Kingdoms under his own rule, was married to his sisters. So not only was he married to his sister, but he was married to both sisters. So why do they do this? They do this because Targaryen blood is necessary to ride dragons, right? We've seen that. Um, the uh, Valerians were never a dragon riding family until Rhaenys joined the, the family. That's a necessary ingredient and the Targaryens just don't want to share that willy-nilly. They want to keep that in the family, so to speak. Uh, and moreover, because Aegon's ascension is going to be contested, people are going to have an issue with it, uh, most notably Rhaenyra and her supporters, the Greens want to make sure that Aegon, everything around Aegon, is uh, uh, supporting his authority and symbolizes his right to rule. And his name does that because obviously Aegon the Conqueror, uh, his name is a reference to Aegon the Conqueror. And the fact that he married his sister as Aegon the Conqueror did is another way of, of solidifying that support symbolically. And it's, it's weird, it is weird, it's a weird thing to do.